All right, fam, so it's 7.20 a.m. and we're here at the facilities, just waiting on guys to arrive so we can get the, the GR out. But we made it, it was a long drive, but we made it. My dad over here. think of this sound so is it attack or this type uh, this type holy uh, we, we didn't really do an s type we did an attack and then when there's a front muffler that you can add on to it so this gotcha. has the front muffler added so it has a muffler it's muffler. not technically s type because it, we didn't develop s type gotcha so it's like in the yeah. middle yeah the in the the tip it sounds side. bitching though it's so I mean, much bro, he drive. turned it on. I was like, what kind of car is that? I was like, there's no way. Yeah, it, it's a it, whole different it, level. Oh, man. I, you know, we did so many test drives developing this, and the difference between the right exhaust and the wrong exhaust is just all No, it, it, it sounds like a JDM now. Yeah. Like, it sounds like a JDM. <laughs> uh, I've been around a long time, and I, I hardly ever get excited about some, the way something sounds, but man, it was like the last car we got. Yeah, yeah, no, that's crazy. I was like, but, uh, you'll, you'll like it. You'll like it. You'll like it. The cold start is a little, no, the course a are, little but, rough. But it's, it's okay to, like, you know, like, but, oh my uh, fucking God. As far as I'm concerned, you know, I don't, I'm not the loud exhaust guy, but yeah. no, if but that's my car, I'd have, I'd have to have that. <laughs> Hello. Maybe I'd put a valve or something on it so I can get out of the, get out of your house in the morning. Right, right.
<laughs> so here's the thing. On this exhaust, me dijeron, they told me it's gonna be the S-Type, which is the quiet one, and the attack is the loud one. So this one is half attack with the muffler on the front. So it's like, all right, and it's like in between, you know. So you told all me about right. like. So the story is, this is dead. No, huh? this isn't the exhaust. Okay. So the technician just came in. Okay. And uh, he's saying that they, uh, we weren't expecting it until eight o'clock. So. Yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, I, I can't wait. No worries. But um, uh, we'll, you, do you want to attack one or? All right, guys. So we're gonna go for a test run. This is actually a creation of Borla. This has that. This one has a front muffler. So we're gonna go and test it out. Let's see if there's any drone, just for a little testing. <laughs> it's quiet, no? All right, guys. So yeah, we're gonna go right and then right. Inside. All right, so we're gonna keep the windows down. You go left. We're gonna go for a little run the block and see see how it sounds. Are you in sport now? Yeah. This car's gonna be too loud, the cop is gonna stop you. Go, go, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna go in shape mode, yeah? You're gonna go in shape mode, you're gonna go higher, better. It's like it's like a good loud, but not a cop friendly loud. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're gonna get a nice send off. Dale, dale. <laughs> no way, this car sounds fucking crazy. This car sounds fucking I'm gonna go live here on on, on Instagram. That's nuts though, that's nuts. Alright, we're here live on Instagram guys. We're gonna send there. We're gonna wait for the signal. <laughs> that's nuts. The car sounds amazing with the board like sauce. <laughs> Amazing with the poor 
Desert Lake sauce. <laughs> so this is the attack muffler. And then the one that's going under there is the best one. That's a little more bigger. Yeah. Quarters and are a little bit different too. And then this is the previous generation. Oh, this one right here. I saw I saw a video on it. Somebody did a video with this, but I was like, yeah, you told me about that last one. I was like, yeah, but that's not the one, the new one for this one. Exactly. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty sure it still fits, but it's not the right one. It, it does still fit, yeah. yeah so but these, it, it, these new mufflers will fit on the old cars. Gotcha, okay. So. Oh, so you, but you can still put it on the other ones too. Oh, yeah. Would it make more noise than the other ones then? These ones will. Okay. okay. But yeah, like that that older S type, if you had to if you had to call it anything now, it would probably be closer to the scoring level. Gotcha. It is a lot better in the system. Gotcha. Still sounds really good, it's just This is the stock muffler. The attack muffler. Now the S one. It's cool that we got two. <laughs> so this is the stock muffler, the stock generator. This is this is big for the A6. No wonder it's quiet then. <laughs> it's really quiet in stock. Uh, I mean, that's a lot. You know, these cars are sold in a lot of different areas of the world, and they just have to. Do different sound effects. Crazy. <laughs> the, the, the tips are crazy. Like five inches. A lot better, huh? Yeah. And they're sticking out like like the proper amount too. Yeah. <laughs> Now we got the S type on. <laughs> All right, guys. So, but that's right behind us. There, the exhaust is insane, guys. We got very lucky to actually. Uh, we're able to put, was, you know, we were able to actually record two of them, you know, the one that we're taking home, we still got to make a sound clip on, but the loudest one, the attack one, so we got very lucky, you guys are going to experience both of them, you know, I want to say a huge shout out to Borlake Sauce for always, I just love working with them, you know, it's, it's, it's truly an, an honor, and it's just it's a sound it's now it sounds like a jdm car absolutely 100 percent now it sounds like a jdm you guys will see the videos of my dad driving and everything we're driving back now you guys are going to see the, the videos experience firsthand I, I i just love it guys it's, it is something else um just wanted to share you, with you guys you know a, a couple of, just literally just a minute you know i remember when i was eight years and my dad had a at his Mitsubishi Eclipse 94 and of course he, he had got the exhaust ever since like I, I honestly can remember my dad has always been into cars you know and his first car here in the states he was a 94 Mitsubishi Eclipse and he had the exhaust which I can't remember now the name I believe it was a Rumble or something like that um, my friend Junior the, the mechanic uh, that did the exhaust for my dad um, I can't remember the name and it's a name that we know too it's not a known known brand, but it, it is it is a brand. But I gotta remember the name, guys. Get back to you on that. But um, it's crazy, you know, because here we are. We're getting emotional here. Here we are, 20 years later, you know, and you know now now with a full on, you know, it, you know, GR86 brand new, you know, out the lot, and the brand new, you know, first in the states, Borlex sauce, you know. Like it's just it's just crazy. It's crazy how life works, fam. You know. My dad has always been into cars ever since I can remember. You know, after that he got a Nissan that he did the same thing, bumper, side skirts, rear bumper. My dad has always been into cars, you know. And maybe that's where I get it from, you know. Even my grandpa, you know, my grandpa, you know, his dad has always been into cars as well. Even my grandpa from my mom's side has always been into cars. So it runs in the family, it runs in the veins, you know, and Having an exhaust is definitely like the way to go, you know. And I'm very happy, you know, very blessed. You know, he's able to enjoy that now. You guys can see the videos how how you know happy he is and it brings joy. It brings joy. It's funny, you know, how life works, you know. Here we are like 20, you know, 18 years plus, whatever, 20 years later. And here he is, you know, it's just it just really brings brings a lot of joy, fam, honestly. 
you know it brings it brings me joy it brings, you know i love seeing him smile you know it's just something that things like this you know it's like a lot of people can say it's material and all that and yeah you know at the end of the day it's still material but you know like if it makes you happy it makes you happy guys you know and having something like this it's not a negative hobby or nothing like that you know it's like it's an expensive hobby fam I, you know I, I you know i always say this since my first car modifying cars is an expensive hobby but it's nothing negative you know my dad has always been into cars showing me that and i think that grew up and that grew up you know he grew up with me you know now my little brother following the same steps you know up to him if he wants to do things like this or not you know where i was going to support him same thing with my son you know being two years playing with his little cars and everything you know like i said you know i'm always going to support you know my brother or my son you know if they want to have this when they grow up or maybe they just want to have a normal stock car you know what i mean but i'm still very happy very blessed guys and i'm beyond happy enjoy the video fam